And we are joined now by Edmonton Elks quarterback Trey Ford. And Trey, we finally got to see you in action, an extended action, last weekend. How great was it to be back on the field? And how has this week been going in preparation for those Rough Riders? Uh, yeah, I mean, it was obviously fantastic to get back on the field and play football again. You know what I mean? The game that I love playing. So it's always fun to get back on the field. And the week of preparation, I thought, has been pretty good. Uh, nothing's ever going to be perfect in your preparation. Uh, but you want to be as close as you can. And uh, I feel like we're pretty close this week, and I'm just excited to play. I know it's been another rough start for the Elks this season, 0-7 for the second straight year. How did you kind of deal with the disappointment? There you are on the sidelines, not being able to go out there and help your team win. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's disappointing for, you know, any sport in any league to start off 0-7. But, um, you know, the guys that we have in the locker room, we have a lot of character in our locker room, so... Uh, I'm not worried about it. I think our team is going to bounce back. And, you know, we have a lot of athletes that haven't been able to display everything they can do on the field right now. But we're going to try to give them an opportunity this weekend to do that. Look, we know you want to play. We know McLeod Bethel Thompson wants to play, but there are only so many snaps to go around. How have the two of you kind of been dealing with that situation off the field this season? Yeah, I mean, there wasn't a lot of dealing with it early on, right? Because he was the starting quarterback for the first, you know, seven weeks. So he got all the reps, which makes sense. You know, it's a professional level. You want your starting quarterback to be ready to play. Uh, but, you know, now that I'm getting reps with the A team, I feel like he's definitely supporting me. And, I mean, we just support each other. That's how it's got to be. It's professional football. You know, things aren't always going to go your way. And I think we both realize that. But we're just trying to make the most of the opportunity we have together. Trey, do you think you're ready to be a full-time starter in the CFL? Uh, yeah, I, I would say 100% for sure. Uh, you know, I think I'm able to make all the throws on the field and then adding the bonus of my legs, able to extend plays and find receivers down the field. Uh, I feel like it's a hard thing for defenses to stop. And the thing with young quarterbacks is the more reps they get, the better they're going to get, right? You, you can, there's nothing you can do to actually simulate real live game reps. And it's really crucial for younger guys to get those reps and be able to develop and get better. Uh, and I'm lucky right now to be in that situation. And you're going right into the fire on Saturday, taking on those Rough Riders and that tough defense. What's the biggest challenge that team is going to present to your team in a couple of days? Uh, well, I mean, if you look at their defense, it's definitely one of the best defenses across the league. I mean, their front four are super dominant, you know, and their DBs are athletic. They're making plays. And, you know, their linebackers are also really, really good. So they don't really have a ton of weaknesses, but we did see some things on the film that we think we can exploit. And uh, we're going to try to uh, you know, attack those areas that we think we can attack and, you know, try to come out with a W. So you're going to watch the game tonight? You're going to support your brother? Oh, absolutely. I'm already, <laughs> uh, already planning to watch it. I've watched all the Winnipeg games, except for the one that was on the same day as our one game. I had a hard time <laughs> trying to watch it after it was a little bit hectic. Fair enough. You had a good excuse there. Uh, Trey, we appreciate you joining us here. Lots of luck, and we're looking forward to see you in action on Saturday.